Who's got the power, the power to read? Who answers the call for friends in need? Super Y! Super Y! He's the guy, he's Super Y! Who's got the power, the power to read? Who looks into books for the answers we need? Super Y! Super Y! And the Super With the Super Readers, adventure waits when you're with Super Y. Super Y and the Super Readers, yeah. Super Y and the Super Readers. Adventure waits when you're with Glad you're here. It's me, Wyatt. Welcome to Storybook Village, where all our fairy tale friends live. Look, our friends are playing at the park. Let's go. Keep pedaling, baby bear. Up and down, up and down. <laughs> Hi, Wyatt. Little Boy Blue and I are having so much fun. It looks like it. <laughs> Uh-oh, that's my mom. Sorry, Red, I have to go now. No! I mean... I'm having so much fun playing. I don't want you to go. Sorry, Red. I have to. Now, I just need my horn. <gasps> Red? Yes? Did you just hide my horn? Maybe. Red, why did you do that? Because I don't want you to go home. I want you to stay and play with me. But I have to go. Uh. Stay. Uh. Go. Uh. Stay. Uh. This sounds like a super big problem. And a super big problem needs us, the Super Readers. We need to call the rest of the Super Readers. Call them with me. Say, calling all Super Readers. Calling all Super Readers. To the book club. To the book club. Come on, to the book club. Wyatt here. P is for pig. Red Riding Hood rolling in. Princess P, at your service. And you, say your name. Great, we're all here. Together, we will solve Red's problem. Let's go. Okay, Red, state your problem. Little Boy Blue and I were having so much fun at the park. But now he has to go home. Oh, oh no. That's, that's too, too bad. bad. What should I do if I don't want him to go? Good question. When we have a question, we look. In a book! What book should we look in? Peas and carrots, carrots and peas. Book come out, please, please, please! Let's read the title of this book. The Swan Maiden. We know what to do. We need to jump into this book and find the answer to Red's question. First, we look for super letters. And then put them in our super duper computer. Super duper computer, how many super letters do we need? Oh, 
In this story, we need eight super letters. And then we'll get... our super story answer! It's time to transform. Ready? Ready! Ready. Arms in! Put your arm in. Super readers, to, to the rescue! rescue. Swan Maiden. When she wore her feathers, she was a swan. Whoa! I'm a swan! When she took her feathers off, she was a girl. Whoa! <laughs> I'm a girl! One day, Swan Maiden played with the prince until she had to fly home. Oh, it's becoming dark! Time for me to fly home. But Swan Maiden, I don't want you to fly home. I want you to stay and play. <gasps> That's just like me. I want little boy Blue to stay and play too. And that, Super Readers, is why we are in this book. Both Red and the Prince want their friends to stay and play. I really want to find out what the Prince does about the Swan Maiden. To the Prince. Swan Maiden, we're the Super Readers, and we want to talk to you. I'm sorry, Super Readers, but I must go home. Goodbye, Prince. No! Wait, Swan Maiden! Stay and play with me! <laughs> Silly Prince, you know I must leave by sunset. I need to fly home to my Swan family before it gets dark. Oh! Now I'll just need my feathers so I can fly home. No! I won't let you have your feathers! Ha <laughs> There! Now without your feathers, you can't leave! Ha! Oh, Prince. I'm sorry. Oh, Summer Squash! The Prince threw my feathers into that tall tree. How can I get them down so I can fly home? Alpha Pig to the rescue! With my amazing alphabet tools, I can make the feathers drop down from the tall tree. And I'll catch them in my alphabet net. A, B, C. Sing with me! A, B, C. Amazing alphabet singing. Okay, for the word drop, 
First, we need the letter D. Hmm, where is the D? There! There's the D! Oh, no! No, no! Phew! Caught one. Next, we need an R. Now, where's the letter R? There! There's the R. Uh, 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 yes! Okay, now we need an O. Do you see an O? There! there. There's an O. Over here, Feather, over here! Yes, got one! Okay, last, we need the letter P. Where's the letter P? There! There's the P. Into the net, little feather. D R O P. Drop! Oh, my chinny chin chin, look at all the feathers. Whew. I'm gonna get them. Over here, feather, over here. Yes, got one. Lickety letters! We found the letters in the word drop and got the feathers to drop down from the tree. <laughs> Let's give ourselves a big thumbs up. My feathers, oh my fluffy, fuzzy feathers! Remember to look for super letters. I just need to put my feathers on. Whoa! Whoa. <laughs> Wow. wow! You see super letters? Which letters did you find? P, L, S! P, L, and S. Our first super letters. We need to put them in our super duper computer! Five more super letters, and then we'll get our super story answer. Great job, super readers. Oh my, it's getting darker. Well, now that I've got my feathers, I'm off to fly home. Bye-bye. No, 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 Swan Maiden, wait. You cannot leave yet. Prince, we've been over this. I must leave by sunset. Now, like I said, goodbye. But but hi -ya! Whoa! I'm a girl again! The prince took my feathers and I need to get home before the sun sets. Ugh! Oh my chinny chin chin! Don't worry, Swan Maiden. We'll help you find them. To the feathers! <laughs> Swan Maiden, your feathers! They're under this heavy rock. <laughs> <clears throat> and boy, is it heavy! How will I get my feathers from under this heavy rock? Cue the sparkle! Cue the music! Princess Presto to the rescue! With my magic spelling wand, I can spell the word lift to lift this heavy rock. One's up. Spell with me. Ready? Hmm. What letter makes the sound ooh? L. L. Write a lowercase l with me. Oh, look, it's working. Now, what letter makes the sound i? I. Write a lowercase i with me. Splendid. <laughs> now, what letter makes the sound f? F. f. Let's write a lowercase f. Oh, almost there. And finally, 
What letter makes the sound t t t? T! T! Let's write a lowercase t. L I F T Lift! Presto! My feathers! Thank you, thank you, thank you! You're welcome! Spectacular spelling! We spelled the word lift and lifted the rock to get the feathers! <laughs> Let's take a bow! You found super letters? What letters did you find? A! O! O! A, O, and O. Now we need to put them in our super duper computer! <laughs> Two more super letters, and then we'll get our super story answer. Right on, readers! Oh, I'm gonna put my feathers on. Whoa! Ta-da! And become a swan again! Now I can fly home. Do -do 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 -do. Okay, Swan Maiden, I'm ready to keep playing. And <gasps> wait a minute. You're a swan again. Yes, I am. I got my feathers back, and now I really must go home, Prince. Look, it's almost sunset. Bye-bye! No, Swan Maiden! Don't go! hi -yah! Whoa! I'm a girl! I need my feather so I can be a... Whoa! A swan! Whoa! Girl! Uh, Woo! A swan! Uh, girl! Let go! Woo! Swan! Uh, girl! You must stop taking my feathers! But I can't! Because it says so in our story. The prince takes the swan maiden's feathers. See? I have to take them because I don't want you to leave. Well, why not? Because if you leave, I'll miss you. Well, I'll miss you too, but I must go. What are we going to do? Super wide to the rescue! With the power to read, I can change this story and save the day. Let's change the word feathers in this sentence. Zap! Why, writer? Right! Super readers, the prince takes the swan maiden's feathers because he doesn't want her to go. What can he take instead of her feathers? Her shoes, her hair, or her picture? Hmm, let's try hair. Which is the word hair? It starts with an H. There! There it is. Now, let's zap it into the sentence. Zap! Let's read it and see what happens. The prince takes the swan maiden's hair. Ouchie, ouch, ouchie, ouch, ouch! Oops, sorry. Hmm, that didn't seem to work, did it? No. No. Taking her hair won't get her to stay. Plus, it hurts her. <laughs> you can say that again. What should the prince take instead of her feathers? Her shoes, her hair, or her picture? Maybe picture. Which is the word picture? That one! There's the word picture. Zap! Let's read. The prince takes the swan maiden's picture. Say cheese! Cheese! <laughs> hey, now that I took your picture, I can look at it whenever I miss you. And I won't feel so sad when you leave. Super job, super readers. The prince took the swan maiden's picture instead of her feathers. And now he won't miss her so much. I love having your picture. 
It will help me remember you until we play again. We will play again, soon! Yippee! Whoa, whoa, Swan! <laughs> See you soon, Prince! Thanks, Super Readers! Bye-bye! Fly safely! You see super letters? Which ones? Y! N! Awesome! Y and N! Let's put them in... our super duper... Computer! We found all of our super letters! Now we can get our super story answer. Super readers, thanks! Come back soon! You're, You're welcome! Bye-bye! Why flyers Back to the book club! We found the super story answer with Super Y! <laughs> Super Computer! Give us our Super Story answer! Read with me! P L A Y space S O O N The Super Story answer is... Play soon! But why? Because even though the Swan Maiden had to go, the Prince realized they could play soon. So my question is, what should I do if I don't want Little Boy Blue to go? And the answer is... Play, play soon. soon! That's right! We can play soon. I'd better find Little Boy Blue. Little Boy Blue, I'm really sorry I tried to hide your horn. I was having so much fun playing with you. I didn't want you to go. But I have to go. I know, but can we play soon? <laughs> Great idea. Hey, maybe you could draw me a picture that I can look at until we play again. Okay. Then I won't be as sad. Here you go. It's you and me. See? I love it! Play soon? Play soon! Hip hip hooray! The Super Reader save the day! Hip hip hooray! Hooray! The Super Reader save the day! We change the story! We solve the problem! We work together so hip hip hooray! Hip hip hooray! Save the day Hip, hip, hooray